Well, um, you're familiar with the Venture Star. What's that? Are you familiar with a craft called the Venture Star? No. Okay. Well, uh, Gordon Novell talked about it many years ago, and there has been pictures on the internet of it. It is uh, said to be flown out of a up near Dugway, Utah, and uh, basically it it carries uh, I don't know fifteen twenty scientists that type of thing. It's not a huge. Uh, craft, but it does go uh, basically up to uh, the moon and uh, Mars at any rate and goes there very quickly. Uh, now, I'm wondering whether you can address this idea of an admiral back in 97 trying to find a secret project and whether or not he as a uh, what is in essence, he was a rear admiral at that time. He was, as I say, the deputy deputy director of uh, the DIA. Uh, not being read in, and at the same time, he wouldn't go looking, uh, in my estimation of understanding military protocol, he, he wouldn't go looking for a project that was hidden and asking questions unless his supervisor, uh, the guy he reports to, had been on board with him doing so, and that would mean uh, we're talking about a general, and that general is General Hughes. He was head of the DIA at the time. And I don't know if you're familiar with General Hughes. Well, first of all, uh, let me address when you say go to the moon and go to the Mars. I don't believe that. I don't believe we've been to the moon. I don't believe we've been to Mars. Now I we know, may. I, I don't know if you're changing your story, but in the past, you've always acknowledged that we had actually we have cities on the moon and Mars. A we, have, we have underground the bases there. We have all kinds of uh, secret space uh, equipment there. And I've got so many witnesses to this, um, you know, that that is kind of over the top. Uh, now, if you want to change your story about that and you want to say we, we're not there, um, then, you know, that's your business and that's okay. Uh, and But if that's the case, then, you know, we probably should move on. But, you know, they're, they're actually, they don't have all this space equipment and secret space program. Uh, to not to not go into space, there is no reason to have a secret space program if you don't go in space. Carrie, yeah, this is you with me. I want you to shut your mouth while I talk. I'm talking okay. right now, actually. Yeah, yeah I was okay. talking. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not going to shut my mouth while I'm talking because that would be that would mean no. I'm not talking. So ago, I, you I know, I'm I'm asking you, you know, I'm asking you a different question. <laughs> If you want to argue uh, right. and go back on stuff you've said in the past. That's fine. But the fact is, at this time, at this point, I don't believe we've been to the moon and I don't believe we've been to Mars. All right. Fair enough. And That's fine. So what is this? Just out of curiosity, where does the secret space program if they don't go to the moon and Mars? Everything is uh, in uh, low Earth orbit. That's all the That's space. That's kind of a waste of time, isn't it? Well, it's a, why would it be a waste of time? I don't know. Why would you be doing this? Uh, Bob Lazar worked on this program back in the 60s. You, you think they've made no progress since then? Are you not just going back and, and basically been told by MJ-12 to just back up on everything? I don't know anybody in MJ-12. Oh, come on. Uh, All right. Let's 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 move on. Let's talk about this at this document leak, Okay. Okay, first we're going to finish uh, your comment from Bob Lazar back in the 60s. It was Bob Lazar in 1979 uh, or 1989 when he came out with his information. He said nothing about uh, going to the moon, nothing about going to Mars. And the fact is, uh, because of the Van Allen belt, uh, we can't go anywhere. We're not Haven't you ever heard of a portal? You, you're not familiar with uh, signal non-locality. You're not familiar with bending space-time. Are you really going back in time that far, John? That's all bullshit. That, you know, it just... Uh, oh, God. You know, this guy, Lou Balden, is is this who you're relying on for your information now? Out, Gary, you know, the fact is <laughs> we can't get there, and we don't get there. All of our stuff is in orbit. Right. Well, yeah, I mean, I, I, I mean, I appreciate your motivation. All right. We've we've got your testimony on that. Can